When you go to Tecton in Wiltshire, you're lucky over a period of time to find some silver Roman coins. And people have asked me what sort of Roman silver I found. Well, I've got my top ten here. My only ten. <laughs> uh, this was the first one that I ever found. It uh, is a nice thick denarius as a fillet, I believe. Uh, these are my own identifications with CBs, but if anybody's watching this and uh, who could clarify anything different for me, then uh, please comment. Philip the uh, First, this dates to about 244 AD, was found uh, near Cricklade about 20 years ago. Nice little silver um, example of a denarius. The second coin to appear a few years later. I was searching part of a, the Roman Ermine Street and you can see I managed to find this lovely silica of uh, Valens. Beautiful little coin. Dates to about 364. It's quite late. Features verse VRBS Roma seated and um, so it's a bit nibbled at the bottom but that came from Ermine Street itself. Again that was found um, in Wiltshire, in Latin. Found a few bronze Roman coins on the road itself, but very, very difficult and tough to get any silver. Uh, about a year later, about 1992, I managed to find this example here. I'm not sure, I think it's, um, I'm pretty sure it's Antonius Pius. About 138, 13 to 61 AD. Again, it features uh, pretty worn on that uh, obverse, but features Fortuna stand in there from the uh, Latin area. Uh, as I say, I don't really venture too far from home, but again, another Valens appeared upon um, I went at Lambourne one day, you know, searching near a, a villa site and. Uh, I managed, apart from finding a Cistercius, I managed to find this by a hedge. Again, it's VRBS Roma seated, uh, Triermin, I believe. That came uh, from a few inches down uh, with my Fisher 1235. Say so Valens is 364 to 75, so again, it's quite a late silica. Very nice coin. And um, on the downs, I think somewhere near Chiserden, I managed to find this lovely example of Julian II. And uh, this would date, uh, this is, again, this is quite a late example. I think it's about 3, 311 uh, on the reverse. VOT, MVLT, cross cross. Uh, nice example. You get, a lot, you get a little bit of a striking split on some of these coins, but. A lovely little bust of, Alan, um, of Julian there, Julian II. Um, it come from the Downs. And in the same area, on a Roman farmstead, probably a couple of hundred yards away, I'm at, uh, about a year later I managed to find this. So about yeah, the year 1998, I think. Uh, not sure, not sure on this one too much, but um, a lot of them do seem to be like a cut down silica, possibly of Valens again. Um, Fortuna or Faustina could be Faustina Junior actually. This one would probably be about one seven five. So you've got Fortune standing there. That was found um, on the Downs again. I think a lot of Roman silver have been found in Wiltshire on the Wiltshire Downs, but it's uh, very nice to get the silver. I think this one was found uh, near Wooden Bassett, funny enough. This is Severus, Sever uh, Severus and Alexander. Dates to about 193. So it's uh, again a beautiful bust. And um, fight standing, I believe, with a shield. Again, any help would be uh, most appreciated, but uh, 
I'm not uh, not known to be an expert on Roman coinage, but um, they don't appear often enough for me to be an expert, really. But this one is probably my favourite. It features on a video a few years ago. Uh, a beautiful Marcus Aurelius uh, denarius, uh, about one six one to one eighty. Beautiful. Um, don't think he's got any striking cracks or anything, but I do like the reverse on this one because it seems to be a little bit more interesting than your standard Roman coin there. It, uh, some some guys seated there. I don't know nothing about this coin because I haven't done any research, but um, it's definitely Marcus Aurelius and it's got a lovely blue tinge to him. It does feature on another one of my videos. That's uh, a beautiful coin. And this one here I found the other week. This was, uh, again, this was on the downs on some Roman site. A very, very debased silver, barbarous coin. As you can see, there's uh, very, virtually nothing on there, but um, uh, there's a little bit of a maybe fight standing on there. Uh, very, very debased and probably declining of the Roman Empire itself. And that one stands in for a coin I gave away a few years ago, so. There's my ten silver coins. <clears throat> the only my top ten and the only ten silver coins I've ever found. I've I've found a few hundred hammered in my time, but uh, the Roman coins are a bit hard. But lovely to find them when you get them in good condition. Hope you enjoyed your video. Thank you very much.